I'm here in uh, the Deerham uh, 24-7 prayer room, which is just a wash with all kinds of stuff. I don't know you see behind me the prayer wall and uh, various other things. So John's here with me, and he's been helping lead the team who's been doing it. So tell us a bit about what's been happening, John, just to inspire yeah. us a bit in about prayer. Well, um, we, we did it a week ago, and um, it's been a really, really amazing thing. I, I, I was quite sceptical, if I'm honest, about doing the uh, 24-7 prayer week, and uh, I was persuaded by some of the others in the church to go for it. And it's been transformative for us as a church. I wonder if we'll ever be the same again. Um, we've had uh, young and old up here. We've had seven-year-olds doing four or five hours worth of prayer through the week. We've had people who never prayed aloud before coming and doing an hour and then coming back wanting more. We've had people saying, one hour's not enough, please can I do two hours or three hours? So really amazing. Anyway, let me try and show you some stuff. Um, behind me, uh, people have been trying to do some creative stuff here, uh, writing some prayers stuff I don't arty stuff I don't like arty stuff but anyway some people do but this this the wall over here this is the amazing thing people uh, were just kind of writing their prayers on the wall it's it's overwhelming originally there were subject headings but it's just all over the place but what we found was people could come up here and they were finding other people's prayers were fueling their prayers so they were coming up here laying their hands on it joining in with the prayers people were weeping when they saw the picture of Jesus on the cross um, and then the little children were writing prayers up here too, Thank, praying for their parents, praying for their school friends. Over here we've got so many schools in the area, praying for all the schools, praying for the police, for the council, the fire service, NHS, the, the army. I mean, it was just extraordinary. And uh, people said that they felt when they came up here, it was like Jesus was waiting to meet them. And as I said, it's been pretty transformative for us the church I recommend 24-7 prayer. I really wasn't sure, but it's just got the hand of God on it. Mm. Try it out. So there you go. That's the best advert I can give. I mean, I'm so excited because I really think prayer is going to be more and more important for us as a family of churches, and we, we're, we're, we're looking to develop some things that we can use corporately as well, and 24-7 is just a wonderful model anyway. So I hope that encourages you, stirs you on to pray. That's another little coffee break. You can have a little think about how you can perhaps implement some of this. Okay, bye. Enjoy your coffee.